Hi friends, thanks so much for watching. Welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, thank you so much for clicking on today's video. Today we're jumping right in to the fall decor shopping starting at Home Goods. I'm gonna walk you guys through all of the home decor at Home Goods, Target, and Hobby Lobby. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up if you do, and let's get right into it. All right, so like I said, we're starting out at Home Goods, and this is one of my favorite places to shop for any season of home decor mainly because they have so much variety in terms of different styles. They did have a little bit of Halloween stuff out as well, so if you are looking to start shopping early, early for Halloween, then you may wanna check it out and see what they have at your home goods. But you guys know my style is definitely more farmhouse, modern farmhouse. I like traditional style, but they have something here for everyone, tons of glam glass pumpkins. They have those ones with pearls. I love these woven rattan ones. They've got lots of different boho items. And then of course they always have Ray Dunn stuff. It wouldn't be a home goods trip if I didn't get some Ray Dunn in it as well. But they have got something truly for everyone. They even had this section here with fall decor if you have like a beach theme or if you have a beach house i just thought that was super cool you could decorate for fall while you are sitting in your beach house or if you have more of like a nautical themed home but anyway something for everyone here at home goods it's one of my favorite places to shop Just a little sneak peek of a couple of things you're gonna see in the hall at the end of this video. I did have to stop by the home office section at Home Goods before I left because I did need a few things for my classroom. And this is a great section to check out, especially for like gifts or just like home organization things. But now we're gonna move on to Target and I had been keeping my eye out over the last several weeks waiting for all the fall decor to come in and I finally think that most of their stuff is here. There were a few sections that were a little bit picked over but there were tons of candles in different sizes and different scents. I love the packaging. And then I did notice that there weren't a ton of florals at my Target, but they did have some. So this kind of gives you a little bit of an idea of what they might have at your Target, a mixture of some different fake florals. And I was super impressed with the pillows in this entire section at Target. I actually thought these pillows were one, they seemingly were better quality than some of the ones at Home Goods, and they were also, in my opinion, way cuter. I don't need any more throw pillows. I think my fiance will probably kill me if I bring another throw pillow home or blanket, so I did pass on this section. But they also had so many vase fillers and pumpkins and just tons of really, really cute little fall decor items. Target is a great place to shop, especially for gifts and things too. They've got things at every price point. All right, so our last stop is Hobby Lobby. I did have to save the best for last. They always have tons of fall decor too, so I wanted to make sure I could cover as much as possible in this video for you guys. But right when I walked in, I was instantly bombarded with so many cute fall decor items. They had tons of outdoor stuff, and I don't have like the best front porch for decorating, but they did have lots of outdoor signs and scarecrows and so many things like that. So if you have a front porch that you like to decorate, then I would definitely check out Hobby lobby for that and then of course they always have so many cute like dishes and kitchen items hand towels so many things for tiered trays too if you guys are a tiered tray lover like I am they have so many adorable things to make your tiered tray super special Oh, I know 
So I just got home and laid everything out on the table so I can give you guys a little haul really quick. Um, and I'm gonna try my best to go over like prices and everything. I'm sure you guys saw that all of the Hobby Lobby stuff was 40% off and they usually do that with their seasonal items. So I'll do my best to kind of tell you about what I paid for some of these um, items from Hobby Lobby. But let's start with the two things that I got from um, Home Goods since that was the first place I started. And this is not fall decor, but I thought I'd still mention it. So since I'm a teacher, um, I actually don't have like a container at school anymore that holds like my pens and pencils. And I like this because it rotates. So um, I can like keep pens and pencils and stuff in here. And this was $7.99, so $8. So this I'm gonna take to work. And I'm also gonna take this blotter to work. And I've seen several teachers of mine, and this would be great for home use too, but I've seen several teachers at my school that are friends of mine that have something like this. And it's just a great way to have um, like things on the calendar that pertain to like work, or you could have one that pertains to your personal life. But I have to like go into my work calendar on my laptop in order to pull up like all the things we have to do for work. It would be great if I had them written down here on the blotter and then if this just sits on my desk then it will remind me like oh Tuesday at like one o'clock I have a meeting or something like that. Um, but I could totally see this being used like for home use as well and this blotter was not very expensive. It was Oh, there it is, $7.99. So again, great deal. Um, both of these are Ray Dunn, so I'm sure if you were to get them like somewhere else, they might be like a few bucks cheaper, but I just think that'll look really nice on my desk. And those were two organization items that I really, really did need. Okay, so these four items are from Target and um, I want to do a like fall, almost like a kind of like go through my fall decor with me because that way you guys can see what all I have. I have been collecting fall decor for a couple of years now. A lot of my fall decor is like bright orange pumpkins. I've also got some of those buffalo check ones that you saw in the clip from Hobby Lobby. I got those last year. So what I love about this is I got some neutral pumpkins just because I think the more different like textures and um, like patterns and stuff like that you have the better. So these ones are super, super popular. I also got a set from Hobby Lobby. Um, this one is from Target and there were three different sizes. This one was $5 for this size. Um, they did have a smaller one and then they also had like a really big one. And these woven um, pumpkins I have seen in multiple places. I just love the way this one looks. I do have like a couple of woven items throughout my house too. So I think it'll really help to tie everything together. And then I also really love, and if you guys have little ones, you might wanna get your hands on some of these soft ones because they are perfect if you keep them like on a lower shelf or somewhere where your little ones can get their hands on them. They're not gonna break. They're not gonna hurt your kid if they, you know, like throw it or play with it. Um, this one was also $5, but it's just like a little bit softer and I love the linen um, kind of like look and texture. Super, super cute. And the last one, again, more of like that neutral. This one is definitely like ceramic, so um, may not be great for little ones. This one is $5 as well. But I just really like how these are fairly neutral and I think that they will go really well like mixed with a lot of the brighter pumpkins I have and even some of the patterned ones just because they're so neutral. And then I did get a candle um, from Target while I was there as well. This one is in the pumpkin brulee scent and um, they are kind of like Bath and Body Works where they have like a scent like this and then they have it in like three different styles of candles. So like if you like a particular pattern, I just like this one because I like the pink and it might look really cute in my office. Um, but that was all from Target. Oh, and this candle I believe was $10, which again, really, really good deal for how large it is considering Bath and Body Works candles. I just can't I just can't justify spending that kind of money on a candle, but this one will burn for a really long time. So that was Target. And then these are the little items I picked up from Hobby Lobby. All of Hobby Lobby stuff was 40% off. So I got all of this for less than $20. Um, most of the items are super small, starting with this little pumpkin. And I kind of like this. I, I don't really have a lot of wired stuff in my house, but 
I just figured because it wasn't super breakable and it wasn't fabric, maybe it could go in a place that um, like gets moisture, like maybe a bathroom or something. But again, all this stuff was 40% off. So a $4 pumpkin turns into like a $2 and something cent pumpkin. So, you know, you get the idea. You can kind of do the math on that 40% off. Um, I had one of these last year and I think I still have one, but I believe I have a chip in it. So I just went ahead and replaced it because these are super inexpensive. Again, this one is $3 regularly. So you can do the math 40% off, super inexpensive. And then I have been wanting one of these rolling pins for my tiered tray for so long. They had several that were there, but this is the one that caught my eye just because of the little ribbon. And then I love the pattern on it. And I think this is going to look so stinking cute in my tiered tray. I'm like super excited about it. Um, but these little rolling pins were $4 and then 40% off of that. I'm hoping that they have more of these for other seasons. Like I really hope they have these at Christmas time because that's gonna be great. Um, I did have to get, again, this little guy for my tiered tray. I'm always looking for small, little inexpensive items that I can put in my tiered tray because it makes a really big statement, but you don't have to spend a ton of money on it. This one was $3, so 40% off of that. And then the last thing I got was this big, oop, this big set of three woven pumpkins, uh, very similar to the one from Target, but this whole set was originally $14. So 40% off of that for three pumpkins is a great deal. Um, better, th better priced than the one pumpkin from Target that I paid $5 for. So I went to Target first. So had I known, I probably would have just gotten like maybe another set of these just because I feel like it's a better deal than buying these guys individually, but they'll go together. All of this stuff looks awesome together and I'm just gonna have to play with like where I want it to go. But let me know in the comments if you guys would wanna see like a home decor, kind of like a haul of all the stuff that I have, kind of go through my bins and show you what everything I've got. Um, let me know in the comments and by hitting the like button so I know if you guys wanna see that. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to hit the thumbs up button. And if you're new here, please consider subscribing. I would love to have you. And I'll see you guys again really soon with a brand new one. Bye guys.